seahorses. It's Mr. Urban and Miss Martinez. And today we are here with Miss Martin's class. Over the past two weeks, we've been learning about air pressure and how it works. Let's start with the basics. Air pressure changes with the weather. When it's cold outside, it's usually because the air in the atmosphere is low. And when it's hot outside, you can expect the air pressure to be high because of the cold air being pushed down. Even though we can't physically see air, we know it's always around us. If we can't see it, then how are we able to measure it? Great question. Scientists measure air pressure with a machine called a barometer. Hmm. This machine also helps the weatherman predict the weather. Today we will be discovering the power of air pressure. Through this bottle rocket, we will be able to test how strong air pressure really is. For this experiment, we are going to create water bottle rockets. After filling a bottle about halfway with water, we place it on the launcher. We pressurize the bottle with the ball pump. We will pressurize the bottle to about 50 psi, 50 pounds per square inch. The pressure will push out the water, forcing the bottle in the air once we release the trigger. Let's check it out. What's up, seahorses? It's Miss Martinez. This past weekend, we had our St. Baldrick's event where people shave their head to donate to kids' cancer. We had two, three students from Coral do this Xavier, Heather, and Chase. For this experiment, we're going to see how long it takes for hair to grow back. Which one will grow the fastest? Whose hair do you think will grow the fastest? Xavier, Heather's, or Chase's hair? Stay tuned and we will share the results in a couple weeks.